Hi there, my name is John Stevens, pastor of Zion Lutheran Church in Oregon City, Oregon, and we're part of the ELCA, and this is Dollar Store Children's Sermon Blog, in which we take a look at the lectionary text and we tie it into an item from the dollar store. And this is Pentecost Sunday, the birthday of the church. Also, as we know, we celebrate the gift of the Holy Spirit as an acts. Uh, it comes down upon, like, uh, looks like tongues of fire and all kinds of gifts are, uh, are uh, shared in the sense of gifts of the Spirit. And then in Gospel of John, Jesus says, I'm giving you an advocate. I'm leaving, but I'm not going to leave you alone. I'm giving you someone who will be with you always. And I got thinking about this, and you know, the Spirit uh, is what drives us forth. The Spirit um, gives us power. And I think of in creation, when God created mankind created humankind when God took the dust and the mold and put, put it all together and then blew air into it that spirit caused life it was great and so at the dollar store I found the balloon car racer that looks like this it's a balloon car racer and it it's fantastic So you've got the balloon that that you blow up and you set it down on the ground and it gets propelled by the air. And it works. It really does. Uh, I'm going to show you this in a moment and I think it's fantastic because think about it. This car, it gets, it gets moved and well, it can't do anything by itself. The air gets blown up by me or by you, by someone else, it gets blown up, and then it moves. That's so much like us, is that we can do nothing by ourselves. It's God that blows into us. It's God that gives us the Spirit. It's God that blesses us uh, with these gifts. And that's the wonderful thing about Pentecost Sunday, is that we are born because God wants us to be born. God blesses us with the Spirit and those gifts. All right, so that's the dollar store item for... Uh, this uh, week and so the uh, balloon racer it works most of the time when it doesn't that's also fun as well so um, thanks for stopping by I hope you have a blessed week